Well, the patience of commuters appears to really be oh. waning with the MBTA. It is taking longer and longer to get to work. And monthly pass holders are wondering if they'll be getting some money back, a refund. One train is still stuck as we talk in Weymouth Landing despite efforts to move it. In fact, crews, watch this. You would think that bump from a locomotive that they brought in would work to get the train unstuck on the Greenbush line. Uh, after four tries, guess what? It didn't work. Riders only found out this morning that the line would be closed because of the stuck train. This morning, Beth Germano is joining us live at Cleveland Circle with the latest on the MBTA's issues. And at this point, when they find out last minute that their transit's not going to be there, these riders must be so frustrated. Jonathan, it's a lot of frustration and lots of confusion among commuters. And get this, the MBTA says whatever your commute was today, you can expect it again tomorrow. No trains along this green line and only very spotty shuttle service. And the MBTA general manager will only say it will gradually improve over the course of a month. Five, six buses pass by. There are many people who are waiting here and they're not getting anything. Waiting and waiting for a shuttle bus at Kenmore Square, and the door closes again in front of Liz Ullman. There's like no direction. I mean, there's no way to get home. It's just crazy. How long have you been waiting for a bus? <sighs> like half an hour. Buses come, they're packed. Buses leave and leave weary commuters behind. I've been waiting for about an hour now. I got here around six from the T, so. How many buses have passed you by? Um, eight. <laughs> It's mounting commuter frustration. No trains on many lines. The only sign, station closed, grab a shuttle bus. And this is what it's been like. This doesn't seem to be very well organized. There's not a single T employee out here telling people where to go. Governor Charlie Baker is pushing to restore service sooner than the MBTA's 30-day estimate. We're viewing that as sort of an outer limit. Our goal is to work collaboratively with them to do what we can to get different parts of the system back online as soon as possible. There was more trouble today when a commuter rail train got stuck on the tracks at Weymouth Landing, requiring a locomotive to free it. Service on several lines was canceled. And when this was the only bus to arrive in Cleveland Circle in an hour, the guy stopped right here, let everybody off, and then we're like, oh, we need to get on Cleveland Circle. And he started inching away. And there's the sign, station closed again tomorrow. Governor Charlie Baker says he won't even talk about MBTA future operations. The focus now has to be on getting service up and running. And here's the answer. If you are an MBTA monthly holder, well, there's no decision yet about whether you will get a refund for missed service. Reporting live from Brighton, I'm Beth Germano, WBZ News.